folks. Welcome back to Failure Retirement. So Mrs. Failure and I came back to the mountains finally. And we don't usually come up here in the winter very much because it's just a lot of work with the snow and everything and digging in. Our place is not that great in the snow. A lot of digging required. So we got the ranger out. This is our rig to get here in the winter. Some of you have seen it behind me in some of my videos. Anyway, we came up here um, a little earlier than usual because we got a birthday party that it was important to us to attend. So here we are and assessing things. Uh, snow's deeper than we expected. So, uh, I guess you've already seen that because I'm going to put some of the footage of driving in in front of the intro. Uh, so you've already seen some of it. Let me turn the camera around and I'll show you what our lot looks like. So there's the ranger again. You can probably see it better now. Storage shed. And the house is over here. And uh, we got, I didn't even expect, honestly, probably half this much snow. It's two and some places closer to three foot deep. But then other places like where I'm standing here where there's more sun, we're probably close to a foot. Anyway, there's kind of across the road toward the neighbors. Um, I don't know if you can see it. I've got some daffodils planted right here and they are coming up. It's a good spot for them in the sun. And uh, they do, these ones do fairly well right here. They'll be blooming here in a couple weeks. Let's see, let me walk over here a little bit. There's a lot of sticks and stuff on the ground. Did a video last year of us raking some of this stuff up. There's my old snowmobile that really I should haul to the junk. Um, haven't ridden it in quite a few years. So that kind of gives you an idea how deep that is right there. And then... It's all down to bear around the shed there. So anyway, we're back up here for birthday party. Gonna have some fun this weekend. Assess the damage here. Over here, under all these trees, it's just never gets quite as deep. These big logs here, the power company decided this tree was no good last fall late. Came in here and cut this tree down. Left all these big logs for me to clean up. So here about a month from now or so. Middle to end of May. That'll be fun getting those out of there. That's one of my next projects. Anyway, other than that, place looks pretty good. That big stump over there, we had that tree removed last fall. That, most of that mess got cleaned up. That tree was dead when we got here in 2015. And it was getting really rotten. And the crazy thing is, that tree is like just barely on our side of the property line, as far as I can tell. Our side of the tree looked fine. The other side of the tree that the neighbors saw was pretty rotten. And they pointed that out to me last summer. And we went ahead and got that taken care of. Anyway, this is what it looks like with a little bit of snow. Pretty happy about the chimney. Last year the chimney was just folded right in half and open when we got here. So that was fun getting up there last summer and repairing all of that. And then it had pushed the chimney down inside like maybe a foot before it folded it over so i had to get inside and redo a bunch of the pipe and get it back down where it belonged or get it up where it belonged rather so and then put some new parts great chimney cap didn't bother it at all but the pipe not so much all right that's it for now i may add some other stuff in as the weekend progresses We'll see. If not, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Failure at Retirement.